we need to be a little cautious about how we use the word text in this context because the Vedic texts, including the Upanishads, were not transmitted in writing until sometime many centuries after their compilation. Rather, they were transmitted orally from teacher to student, often indeed from father to son. And when one actually stops and looks for a moment at the, the length and the complexity of some of the Vedic texts, one realizes what an incredible achievement it was to memorize and transmit those texts accurately. What is perhaps even more amazing is that there are people in India today who still have that ability to recite some of these texts from memory. 